All right, here's a quick look at the, I found the calendar app at the, <clears throat> inside the app world. Um, if you go here to the app world, uh, you can go to categories, or to utilities, and again utilities. And I found the calendar app. It's not the greatest app, or calendar app. Let me switch it this way. This is called scheduler. It's very limited. It doesn't have really, you can't sync in uh, to your Google Calendar, which would have been nice. But if you really have to have a calendar, um, I guess this is, you know, something you can get started on or wait for the calendar that would be released from RIM. Um, let me show you. Uh, most of these apps are only landscape view. As you can see, the calendar it's gets cut off here, so you have to actually scroll up. So I guess you know it's just the beginning, and there's no if you try to slide for any settings or anything, doesn't have anything. It's, the settings are up here in this corner, where you can um, add by colors or go back to today. And um, when you click on a date to insert something, you get this pop-up menu, which by the way should fit a little bit better but you have to scroll up so you know you can put the time and date um, let's say uh, start time is uh, 11 and it ends at oops, sorry uh, this is a uh, start time is at 10 and it ends at 11 you can put a title I'll just put um, let's go put test and if you have a group field you can put personal or whatever you want uh, description uh, do and I gotta show you guys another little tip here uh, if you get grab this corner here you, you can swipe it up and it brings up the keyboard it's only on this corner of your well, see again you can't put this in portrait mode uh, most of these apps I've noticed now, uh, they're all landscape, which I, I don't mind because it has this, the way this is kind of built, I think it actually, everything works better uh, landscape mode. But anyways, let me, uh, I'll go again and see how you can get the, just remember that this corner, um, you can just slide up, that's like a shortcut um, to bring your keyboard. Go ahead and hit add, and as you'll see, you'll now have a, uh, a calendar app um, it's nothing fancy or anything but this is kind of basic so you can use this in the meantime which is you know pretty good but I, I still would like if this would have been able to sync to my Google Calendar then I can have everything syncing together but you know this is a good start while the official calendar gets released so that was just a quick uh, I want to show you how to install a calendar app in the meantime from the world.